Dear friends, today I would like to discuss one question out of the syllabus that means not it is not available in your textbook. But according to me, I would like to discuss this one question for your better knowledge. Many times you need some extra kind of knowledge for the same chapter. We don't have any boundaries about the knowledge, so I would like to discuss one example with you. So if it is possible, you have to write down the question along with me. I would like to dictate with you. Okay. The question is for two variables, rank correlation coefficient. For two variables, rank correlation coefficient R is equal to minus 0.5. R is equal to minus 0.5 and sum of d square and sum of d square is equal to 330 330 find the value of n my dear friends in this question they have given sum of d square that is 330 so please pay attention on the board <coughs> Sum of d square is available, it is 330 and the amount of r is available minus 0.5. My dear friends, with the help of this answer, we have to find out the value of pairs. How many pairs should be taken? But many students are getting confusion. Sir, which formula should be taken? Because of we have two formula. One formula is without correction factor and one is with correction factor. So my dear friends, if there is no clear instruction about anything of tie situation. So always we have to use the formula without correction factor. So now I would like to use here. So R is equal to 1 minus 6 sum of D square divided by N into bracket of N square minus 1. So R we have minus 0 0.5. 1 minus 6 into 330. And we don't have n. So right now this information as it is. Now change the side of 1. So minus 0 0.5. Minus 1 is equal to minus. It is 0, 6, 3, 7, 18. And 1, 9, 8, 0. And divide by n into bracket of n square minus 1. Here we have minus 1.5 is equal to minus. 1980 divided by n into bracket of n square minus 1. Both sides and negative sign is cancelled. So now change the sides so to n into bracket n square minus 1 is so n into bracket of n square minus 1 is equal to. So 1980 divided by 1.5 it gives you 1320. So my dear friend, see here the answer of this thing is 1320. And what is n square minus 1? It is equivalent to a square minus b square, my dear friends. So what are the factor of a square minus b square? It is called one time negative and one time positive. So I would like to mention over here n, n here is n plus 1 and n minus 1 is equal to 1, 3, 2, 0. So now we have to arrange these three product situation into a Descending order. So first we take higher number, then smaller it is called n, and then the smaller one n minus one. It is one thousand three. My dear friends. So we have to find out the numbers. The three uh, product of three consecutive numbers gives us result one thousand three twenty. And we have to think about such numbers. Which are the numbers? So higher number, smaller one, and the smaller one. Okay. So my dear friends, we have one more option. Factorize the standard So we have the factor 12, 10, and 11. And we have to write now in this order higher. So it is 12, then 1 lower, 11 into 10. So it is n plus 1, n into n minus 1. Now both the sides are equal, that means our first term is equal to first, second is equal to second and third is equal to third. You can take any of the comparisons, suppose I would have to take the easiest one, n is equal to 11. Or you may compare n plus 1 is equal to 12, so n is equal to 12 minus 1, so n is equal to 11. In any of situation you get the same answer, 
n is equals to 11. My dear friends, you need to take more practice. Many of the school teachers are going to say n into n square minus 1 is equal to 990. We know it, our answer is 10. We know it, our answer is 10. Many school teachers are going to be by heart the values. If it is 990, you can take 10. If it is higher, you can assume it 11, 12, 13. Because of 990, so our answer is 10. Here your amount is 1320. So you have to be assumed the higher amount. So instead of 10, you can go for the 11 one. If your things are going to match, you can accept your answer. But this is the right way of the calculations, my dear friends. We do one more example of same kind. Okay friends, one more question of the same kind I would like to share with you and the question is The sum of squares of differences The sum of squares of differences between ranks of two variables between ranks of two variables x and y is 72 if the correlation coefficient if the correlation coefficient between the variables between the variables is 0 0.4 find the number of pairs find the number of pairs of observations so my dear friends for this question they have given the amount of r that is 0.4 and they have given sum of d square is equals to 72 now we continue with our formula so r is equals to 1 minus 6 sum of d square divided by n into bracket of n square minus 1 so here it is 0.4 is equal to 1 minus 6 into 72 divided by n to bracket of n square minus 1. So 0.4 minus 1 is equal to minus 6 to 12, 42 and 432 divided by n to bracket of n square minus 1. So minus 0.6 is equal to minus 432 divided by n to bracket of n square minus 1. Both sides negative side is cancelled. Now interchange the sides so n into n square minus 1 is equal to 432 divided by 0 0.6. So now it is n into bracket n square minus 1 becomes 720. Now we have to move for the calculation. So n then n plus 1, n minus 1. The factors like a square minus b square, so one time negative, one time positive is equals to 7. 20. So arrange it in the descending order so n plus 1 then n n minus 1 and my dear friends I, according to me your the product of three consecutive numbers becomes 720 and we have to think what are the numbers 10 into 9 into 8 so compare it your answer so n is equals to 9 my dear friends you can make it your value like in this way it is 360 to the 180 to the 90 to the 45 to the 15 3 the and 5 3 the and 5 and the 5. So these are your values. So 3 3 the 9, 5 2 the 10, 2 2 the 4 2 the 8. These are the numbers. 8, 9 and 10 and that now in the descending order 10, 9 into 8 and you can make it your answer so n is equal to 9 and I think all you are comfortable how to get answer in these situations am I right? thank you very much my dear friends